Wells Fargo Arena officially empty after state wrestling officially kicked off here in 2022 with a dual team tournament. We talk about this is the time where young wrestlers across the state are trying to etch their names in the history book and the 3A dual team final is one people will remember for a long time. In an instant classic, we begin this duel in the 182 pound class. Rams up 20 to 15 and talk about a clutch situation right here by Southeast Polk's Harrison Gibson. He gets the pin on Tyler Gast, calling it huge would be an understatement. 26 to 15 Rams. However, Waverly Shell Rock is the number one seed for a reason. And we see a great response here from McCray Haggerty. He gets the pin of his own, and we are back to within a five point Rams lead, 26 21. The scenario entering the 220 pound match was simple. If the Rams win this, they are the state champions, but another clutch Gohawk effort, this time by Jake Walker. He gets a couple of takedowns and he wins his match five to three. So it's all gonna come down to this. The heavyweights will decide the state title. Final period, Lane McDonald is up on Cooper Martinson, but it won't matter. McDonald, the pin, the walk-off pin, delivers Waverly Shellrock its second straight dual title. Southeast Polk falls in a thriller, 30 to 26. I thought our guys wrestled really hard. They wrestled well. We just, you know, lost a match I thought we were going to win and then, you know, just didn't have things go our way. But guys competed hard and I think that'll help us out leading in this weekend. Hopefully they're a little more motivated. If the dual team tournament is any indication, the entire weekend is set to be action packed and full of excitement. We continue things here tomorrow when the individual tournament kicks off bright and early at 9 a.m. Reporting from Wells Fargo Arena, Jeff Dubroff, KCCI, Iowa Sports Leader.